Greetings from Hiroshima. I'm honored to have the opportunity to send a video message to this meeting of Europe for Peace. My understanding is that you are meeting against nuclear armaments and new military bases, and I'm grateful to the organizers and all involved for taking this initiative. I am eager to learn more about what is happening in your part of the world, so I very much wish I could be there with you in person. I have heard that you are standing up for your citizens by expressing your collective opposition to the NMD installation proposed for your territory. Here in Hiroshima, we are frightened by what appears to be a completely unnecessary attempt to rekindle the Cold War, and we are more than grateful to you for resisting. Someday, I hope, we'll have national leaders capable of understanding that missile defenses and the weapons they are designed to defend against are all obsolete artifacts of a barbarian era that we must quickly put behind us if we are to survive. In the meanwhile, it is vital for mayors to stand up and declare that war is not an acceptable method of conflict resolution and cities are not targets. We cities must reject from the outset the notion that any power struggle at the national level can legitimately threaten or result in the annihilation of entire cities filled with innocent non-combatants wishing only to live in peace and mutual prosperity. The Mayors for Peace 2020 vision campaign seeks to protect the entire human family, not through threats and defenses, but through dialogue, negotiation, and the rule of international law. Our civilization has become too fragile and interdependent to manage with the brutal and insensitive tools of military force. The delicate and complex problems we face today can only be solved through careful reasoning, negotiation, and cooperation. In the long run, we must find peaceful means of resolving our conflicts. In the short run, we must prevent war and especially the use of nuclear weapons. As a member of NATO, the Czech Republic is in a position to be extremely helpful. We need your national government to take a strong and unequivocal stand against the presence of nuclear weapons in your country and in Europe. I hope you will all use whatever influence you may have at the national level to encourage such a stance. Mayors for Peace will hold an executive conference in Florence, Italy this November. At that meeting, we will greatly strengthen our 2020 vision campaign. In the coming months, you will begin to hear much more about Mayors for Peace and an increasingly intense global campaign for the abolition of nuclear weapons. People tend to think that nuclear weapons are simply an unfortunate fact of life that no one can do anything about. However, this is a struggle the forces for peace can and must win. In fact, this struggle will be easy compared to our other struggles with poverty, violence, global warming, and environmental degradation. Furthermore, if we do not win this struggle, we have little chance of solving our other problems. Please sign the registration form and join Mayors for Peace today. And please do whatever you can to support the 2020 vision campaign. Will we eliminate nuclear weapons or will nuclear weapons eliminate us? The answer to these questions will have a profound effect on our future, especially on the lives of our children and grandchildren. Let's all work together to give them what they need most, a safe, secure, and sustainable nuclear weapon-free world. Thank you very much.